Class of 2018, how you feeling? Woo! First off, I would like to thank my mother for literally everything she has done for me. So, Mom, wherever you are, thank you. I would also like to thank both the Performing Arts and Philosophy departments for influencing me in very different yet extremely significant ways. And lastly, to Dr. Ryan Johnson, thank you. Anyway, we made it. We finally made it to graduation, and it wasn't a guarantee. We don't have to be here right now, and making it to the end of our senior year and walking across this stage is a major accomplishment, no matter what job or lack of job you have lined up right now. <laughs> so I want to be the sixth millionth person to say congratulations to all of you. Now, whenever I talk to anyone older than me and mention that I am a senior in college, they typically smirk and say something along the lines of, Enjoy it while it lasts. It'll be gone in a blink of an eye. Gone in the blink of an eye. Y'all, did this feel like a blink of an eye? <laughs> did these past 1,362 days, give or take, feel like a blink of an eye? No, it may have, but think back to your first day on campus, the first friends you ever had, the first time you walked through Historic and said, hey, this place is kind of nice. That was ages ago. To think of who I am now and to think of who I was back then, I'm a completely different person. We're all completely different people, and our Elon experience will forever define who we are and what we do. A wise woman, let's call her Dr. Book, <laughs> once said that the two most important and influential decisions we'll ever make in our life are the school we choose to go to and the person we choose to spend the rest of our life with. So y'all, we're about halfway there. <laughs> Or, if you're like me and you'll never find love, we've already made it. <laughs> so congratulations. Thank you. In all seriousness, this wasn't a blink of an eye. We walked onto this campus somebody and left somebody else. When we first made it to Elon, it was one of the first times we were seemingly on our own, free from our parents' expectations. We had the room to be whoever we wanted to be and the time to figure out who we truly were. I thought I wanted to be an actor, but I soon realized that at a nationally ranked theater school, I'm a pretty poor actor. <laughs> I'm sure we've each had a similar experience, a reality check that made us question ourselves, our goals, and our entire being. And it's tough, but I urge you all, remember the experiences and especially the struggles you went through at Elon. I soon learned I couldn't act, so I tried something new. I joined organizations like Elon Tonight, Mock Trial, and Student Government knowing full well that without, that without that reality check freshman year, I wouldn't be here right now. And I'm afraid in the midst of our future lives, it'll be easy to forget this process, to call it a blink. But that simply undermines the magnitude of these past four years. In this blink of an eye, we've met some of the best friends we'll ever have. In this blink of an eye, we discovered our passions and began our professional path. In this blink of an eye, we've won championships and studied abroad and volunteered in Alamance County and did research and saw Mr. Wives live, and that's only a fraction of our time here. It's going to be crucial to understand how our actions at Elon led to success, how success led to failure, how failure led to growth, and how growth led to us. Remaining conscious of our past will help us forge our path into the future. Because it's coming. In no time, believe it or not, everyone, we're gonna be old. <laughs> We're gonna be 30. <laughs> and after new jobs and friends and love and heartbreak and loss and pets and kids and bills and decisions and what could have been and what should have been and what is and what will be, it'll be easy to look at these past four years and to say they were a blur, a blip, a blink of an eye, undermining the fact that every action and decision we make for the rest of our lives will be influenced by this experience. So, Class of 2018, don't let it be a blink. Make it more than that. Thank you.